Samsung has officially started rolling out the One UI 8 update for the Galaxy S25 series worldwide. This update is based on Android 16, and it's now reaching users outside of South Korea, owners of the Galaxy S25 S25 Plus, S25 Ultra, and S25 Edge are among the very first to get the software. The timing is right on schedule. Just a few days ago, Samsung shared a rollout plan for Brazil, and now we're already seeing the update in Europe and other regions. This shows that Samsung is moving fast, and if things keep going this way, a large number of devices in different markets should receive the update before the end of the month, but not everyone is celebrating. If you live in the United States, the update hasn't started rolling out yet. US users are still waiting and this delay isn't surprising. For years, American carriers have been known to slow down major Android updates. Unfortunately, the same thing is happening again. While Galaxy S25 users in Europe are already enjoying the new software, those in the US may need to wait a few more days or even a couple of weeks depending on their carrier. On the other hand, Europe is full of activity. Users in France, Germany, Sweden, and the UK are confirming they've received the update, and many of them are already sharing screenshots online. Reports are also coming in from the Caucasus region, which shows that Samsung is not limiting the rollout to just one area. Key markets such as India, Brazil, and Australia are also expected to receive the update very soon, which means the expansion is happening across multiple continents at the same time. Now let's look at what comes next. Samsung isn't stopping with just the S25 series. According to the official schedule, the Galaxy S24 lineup is expected to get one UI 8 next week. That includes the S24 S24 Plus, S24 Ultra, and the S24 Fe. Around the same time, the Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 are also expected to join the rollout. This means that by September 25th, users in Europe, Asia, and South America could be moving on from One UI 7 and enjoying the new One UI 8. Experience. This faster rollout is already a big improvement. Compared to what happened with One UI 7, many users still remember the delays and poor communication earlier this year, which left them waiting for months. It was a frustrating process. This time, however, Samsung seems determined not to repeat the same mistakes, and Samsung's plans don't stop there. October is expected to be a massive month for updates. Stable One UI 8 builds will begin rolling out to a wide range of devices, not just the newest flagships. The Galaxy S23 series, the Z Fold 5, the Z Flip 5, the S20 to family, and even mid-range models like the Galaxy A55, A35, and A26 are all on the list. Samsung is even planning updates for entry-level devices, such as the Galaxy A06 and A07. Along with tablets like the Galaxy Tab S8, if Samsung can actually deliver this schedule, it will be one of the most ambitious and successful software update rollouts in the company's history. But here's something to keep in mind. Should you update right away? For many users, the answer is yes, but it's also smart to be careful. Big software updates can sometimes bring unexpected issues like bugs, app crashes, or battery drain. While One UI 8 looks promising, you may want to wait for a few days and see what other users are saying before updating immediately. That way, if there are any serious problems, you won't be the first to face them. So, what's actually new in One UI 8? This update isn't a complete redesign, but it does bring several meaningful improvements. Samsung has focused on performance, stability, and small tweaks to make the experience smoother. These changes may not seem huge on the surface, but they can make your phone feel faster and more reliable in daily use. Keep in mind that the download size will likely be large, so make sure you have enough storage and a strong internet connection before starting the installation. Interestingly, even while One UI 8 is rolling out, Samsung is already working on One UI 8.5, Firmware for the Galaxy S25 Ultra has been spotted on Samsung's servers, which shows that development is moving quickly. It doesn't mean One UI 8.5 will launch right away, but it's likely to debut with the Galaxy S26 series next year. For now, we don't know much about what One UI 8.5 will bring. There are rumors of an improved Samsung internet browser and other small features. Samsung has also tightened security around firmware leaks, so it may be harder to get early details this time. Still, it's safe to say that the Galaxy S26 series will come with One UI 8.5, and testing for it could start on the Galaxy S25 Ultra before that. This fast pace also shows how seriously Samsung is taking the competition. With Apple recently launching iOS 26 and adding many new features, Samsung needs to keep pushing forward. 
Fans are watching closely to see if Samsung can match or even beat Apple's progress in software. For now, though, the spotlight is on One UI 8. The rollout has already started worldwide. Europe is leading the way and other regions are close behind. If Samsung keeps this momentum, users everywhere will soon enjoy a smoother, more stable, and overall better experience on their Galaxy devices.